Welcome to an introduction to accounting and to Sage Line 50. In this short podcast, we are going to show you how to generate one of the most commonly used reports in accounting, and that is the trial balance. Remember that for each transaction, there should be a debit and a credit, or debits and credits, and for each transaction, the total of the debit side must equal the total of the credit side, which means that when we look at all of these, if we go to our financial reports here and go to the trial balance, we'll take the period trial balance and preview it. We'll look at everything that's on the trial balance at the moment for the financial year, hence it says to the 12th of March 2013 on this one. Now I'll just make that large enough so that we can see it. There we are. And you can see that Anyway, there we are. The total of the debits and the total of the credits are the same, right? It tells us exactly what the balance is in each of our nominal accounts. So we know there's a debit balance of 330,000 in freehold property. We know that in the creditors control account there is a credit balance of 6,448 pounds 80 and so on. And as I say, if you go to the bottom of this, the total of the debits must equal the total of the credits. One of the things to look out for when you are generating a trial balance is right at the bottom here, if there is something called the suspense account, then that is a problem that needs to be investigated. You can either print this to a printer, just open it up, right, if I clicked OK, I would then get a hard copy of that out to a printer. Or I could export it as a PDF. R. Or I could export it as an Excel file, right? Or one or two other forms as well. Let's cancel that. Now, if I close that and just go to the period trial balance again and preview it, but instead of saying to the 12th of March, I'm going to say. Let's only look at those transactions that have taken place up until November. So I will click OK. And now I have only those that have taken place until November. I can go back again and preview it and say, OK, let's go back before November. Let's see what was actually in there at the end of July. And at this point I can see that there were a number of transactions obviously that have been entered since then because this total is lower than the previous totals we were looking at. So that's the trial balance, probably one of the most frequently used of all the reports. And remember, debits will equal credits, total debits equal total credits. And always check to make sure there is nothing in a suspense account. If there was, it would appear down here. Thank you.